like there is no O, smaller. We just we just created it because that performance didn't have any. It it was just to name the particular thing we were doing, which felt so strange and didn't really have any sense. Okay, great. Um, so talking about the character that has no name, um, the radical empathy call, um, which you participated in with this artwork, was also based on a character um, from a cyber novel of the founder of Wendy Network by Mikhail Mastro Totaro. And this character's name is actually Wendy. <laughs> and she, well, we identify her, we understand her as an explorer, a creator, a magician, a rebel, and um, do you find any connection, like how did you initially find connection between your performance and this open call, like what was the process? Well, I, I, I connected to the, to the word radical empathy somehow, but also this connection with, with the character Wendy was, was an interesting one because I understood that it's a this amazing character full of different uh, meanings. I just I, I I just understood it from the depiction that was in the call, and I saw that it somehow relates with this character who is also it actually looks a little bit like a, uh, somebody said like a wizard of Oz, the the witch, the yeah. witch, the wizard yes. of Oz. Um, and and yeah, so so I saw that there is connection, and also I kind of understood from the depiction of Wendy that that sh she has some kind of life, and then she is doing something else, and it's perceived like she has two two sides. There there are there are two two sides to her, like how how she is perceived. And I was thinking that this character also will cause uh, some controversy because um, because I oh and uh, th there is there is another thing that I was writing also in when I was applying that that the 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 cyber novel of uh, Michael Mastro Totaro. Machfeld was created the same year as as the performance bank yeah That's so true. It, was, it was born in the same year and i was like there is enough connection already actually <laughs> it's a big thing if you are born in the same year with someone i always find because i actually in my life when i was meeting new people i didn't find so many people who would be born the same year everybody's always older or younger or whatever but I saw that that's actually that's actually kind of cute, you know, something really nice that that we couldn't think of. Yeah, we, you couldn't create it; it just happened, and we didn't know about each other. Yeah? I didn't know about Mastro in '99, and he didn't know about me. So interesting. Um, yes, I haven't even thought of it. That's such an interesting yeah, observation. Yeah, the same, the same year it was born. So wow. Um, yeah, and, and then I was going to talk about the, that the, the word radical empathy was something that came to my mind when I was thinking back of, of this performance because um, how to explain? I was a little bit concerned about it because um, because that was a charity event and I and it's to kind of inspire people to help and to donate and then I thought I hope it didn't turn people off or how to explain how it, uh, because it's uh, it's something different like what you expect it's not <laughs> how to say it's a bit of a mischief to be honest to bring this this crazy character into life again for this event Doma Dobre which is a charity event right a little bit of a of a <laughs> it's a little bit rude in a, in a way not to show some high art right 
to kind of uh, influence the, the, the high feelings of people because I, I knew that it won't be taken like any, any high art, like probably there would be more suitable forms of art to kind of create that, that, that conventional appeal, right? So I saw that it was a little bit rude and I, and I was a little bit concerned if it won't be taken badly, if it couldn't like maybe damage the whole idea that this is to support a charity. So I was a little bit concerned, yeah. but in the same time, it was the same time, it was a, in the same time, it was a character that, that to me completely corresponded. Like to me, it would be, it would be not right to, to maybe show a great dancer dancing the route. You know what I mean? Like, um, <laughs> promote his dance and his, his, himself, right? So I don't know if, if you know what I mean, but uh, there was a little bit of a, um, that, that, that's, what I, that's what I found a bit radical about it, that it, I, I was sure that it will cause uh, controversial reactions on it and, and they were, and they were, so. That is so interesting that you see it that way because to me personally, it immediately caused empathy because I saw someone in a bus Somewhat, especially I liked the scene where um, you were following some people that didn't know you and they were just ignoring you completely and feeling a little bit like awkward next to you and you were just following them and I was seeing it like the way perhaps even I act on the daily basis when I see people homeless people passing by like I don't pay attention to them often I don't even look at them and, and that really caught, like, it, it helped me to immediately understand. So it's, it's, very, um, it's very strange that you look at it so self-critically because, well, for me, it was an immediate reaction there. So, um, but of course, I do understand what you mean, that it is a little bit radical. It, it does require some contemplation, but I think this is so beautiful, so... Um, and yeah. yeah, maybe, maybe it is, uh, uh, yeah, you're right. Uh, maybe it is a bit self-critical because, because when I put it there, I didn't think of that. I just sort of bringing this character and I, then I'm, then I'm in it and I don't think like, like a person who is then seeing the result, but I, I think like a character, I, I actually am out of my mind in that, in that time. I am some somebody else. I'm I am somewhere else, and I do things, and then uh, I cannot control it. It's there is no self control in the performance. But then I thought, and before, because the president was there, the president of Slovakia was in this charity event. Yeah, she was just leaving, or I don't know how it was when whatever. But <laughs> but. I was a little bit thinking. Oh, I hope I, it, it won't. It won't be too much, uh, like too 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 wide um, contrasts, yeah. But I saw the that was that was actually also the the, the radical thinking and the very. Ah, uh, how say, the thinking of the of the festival director that that he just saw that it fits and he never doubted anything. So, um, so I'm, I'm glad that, that, it, that it happened. And <laughs> yeah, those people that you mentioned, they, they went to work. There were also some like buildings of some companies on the way there. So they, and you know, you, you know, it was, it was basically a lockdown at that time. That's right. That's right. They were even, yeah, they were even more afraid of anything on the street that is strange because I, I had I had covering in the bus and in the dormitory, but outside I didn't have the the covering. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, so. indeed, it, it adds a, a another layer of complexity there. Um, and you also used a very, um, I, I can call it a radical sound. It was a very, uh, well, you could immediately notice the soundtrack. It was quite uh, chaotic. Uh, can you tell us a bit, like, what does it represent in, in this artwork? Uh, so the, 
so of course because this was going to be streamed uh, we were thinking it will take the real sound of the environment but in the same time it's a dance so maybe it would be nice to to have some music with it too and uh, so I, I i was offering some music uh, with the director we were talking about it and and i offered uh, three three uh, compositions that were used uh, uh, like in the original performance it was oscar rojas uh, he was creating music live in that performance so i uh, suggested that then there was another solo that came out from this performance and then that used uh unofficial track of u2 of the band but it was an unofficial recording <laughs> so uh that was the second option and the third option was kk now and his uh, uh excerpts of his album cosmista noisa that we used in one um performance that was not original Wang, it was called Beta, Beta Wang, it was created later and it was only on a special occasion, performed only a few times and, uh, and we used his music for that. And, and the director saw that that would be good music. Okay, okay. It was definitely the, definitely the most... Um, <laughs> crazy music with it, I would say. Well, not crazy is not the good word. Uh, you, you, you see, it's a noise music. It's a noise music. Yes, it's, it's very prominent. Like, you can definitely hear it. It's not just on the background. It kind of stands for it by itself. Yeah. Um, yeah. And also, also the, the, the volume, the, the, <laughs> it should be played on, on a bigger volume, right? Because noise music is, I, when I when I saw KK now on the concert, I, it was I was in a very bad moment of my life when when it happened, and then this concert started. The the amount of the the level of of sound of noise was like amazing. It was like you couldn't escape, couldn't escape. You couldn't get out of the space because it just took you and held you and no other option so 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 i was kind of happy that he went for this maybe more still looking for the word to describe like e extreme and kind of raw maybe raw would be a good word uh, sound of this industrial kind of noise music that that actually responded to the site i think the best because the it's outskirts of bratislava and there is actually a, some 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 factory in the back and uh, so it's a little bit like and it's winter time but there was no snow so no magic only like the pale, the pale whatever kind of gray and you know the trees without leaves and the, the ugly buildings and and then the highway, you know, the, there is there was a part when there is a bridge, and there are cars going this way, and cars going that way. That that's when I got lost, actually, because I came on the bridge and I was turning, and I lost the orientation, and then I continued and I went back. I was returning <laughs> <laughs> because it, everything was the same on both sides, and it took me like two hundred meters to 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 realize that I'm going back. Then I turned, and you can see it in the video because they left it there. And I was saying, please take it out, <laughs> cut it, edit. <laughs> but they saw that it's a it's a good moment because <laughs> that's what can happen, and uh, it totally happened. Yeah, I I completely lost my way on the on the straight road. Yeah. So then I was coming back. The people in the uh, the who were directing the drone that was recording, they were panicking, they were like, what, did, what is she doing? Why, why is she going back? <laughs> Coming to that, I wanted to ask, why did you decide to join Wendy Network in the first place, given that it is a, well, a completely digital platform for artists at this stage?
Well, first I was uh, very intrigued by what uh, Mastro, Michael Mastro Totaro uh, is doing, because it's an old friend of mine. We, 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 we know each other since 2004 or so, I think, and, and, and Bine Meyer, Sabine Meyer, yeah, who were together and still are together in, in Machfeld, which I know and we collaborated together. So I was interesting because they are the, <laughs> they are the avant-garde uh, media people, art that looks on other forms, sometimes completely unknown to me. And I'm always, I always want to be interested in what they do because that's, a, that's the future. <laughs> For me, that's the future of, of or some, some future possibility for one way of how art can go. So I was just curious and also I was asking, uh, is, it, is it, can I join even though I don't understand anything about the, 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 the cyber? The crypto thing, art, yes. The crypto art and the, the cryptocurrency and stuff like that. I have no idea, I, till now. I'm, 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 I'm trying to find out, uh, trying to find time to, to find out. Yes, I'm lot of, in a lot of work and, and it seems like I'm still losing the, 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 the first connection, like the, the reason how it was created. Mm -hmm. So I'm still leaving time in the summer to go through all this, like well, what actually is happening on what Wendy Network is based. Yeah, but, but it was the curiosity basically and, and it, it, it gives a space that uh, that some work can be presented because you know, like my work, it's done in a performance, and if it's not recorded, it doesn't exist. It's gone, and never you never see it again. And actually, actually, it is gone because what you see is a video. You don't see the performance. You see the the representation of it, right? But it can give some some feeling, and it can give some maybe something else because I I. I I think that a lot of things also on Wendy Network is mostly visual and maybe a little bit um, not not so body based maybe even though I saw some 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 body art there like some action art and so I hope I hope I'm not that like completely out of space because um... <laughs> no not at all <laughs> trust me trust me not at all uh, there are still a lot of people and also in within the net Wendy Network that are still figuring things out and we are working on it as well so for example in a month from now we will be having like a wendy network quarterly meeting in which well it's very fun because you kind of see the space like in a video game and you can enter different rooms and in each room we will be having different discussions or different presentations so people get to know not only each other but also get to know a bit more about Wendy Network from both technical side and the ideological side. So you're more than welcome to join. Right. Yes. This, is, this is a way to connect people around the world. And the, the, <laughs> that's the option that is absolutely unique. Like, 